Morning thoughts, morning thoughts, morning thoughts. It's the freaking weekend, baby. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna. People are gonna dance with laugh because I always do the morning thoughts or a lot of the morning thoughts I've been doing in the um, bathroom, right? Now let me get one in the shower. <laughs> Yo, uh, hey man, welcome back to SoFlo TV again, everybody. It's your host of the most. I haven't done a morning thoughts in a whole week. A whole week because, as you know, I was in Jamaica. Not that I couldn't have done morning thoughts in Jamaica. My eyes are tired. Came in yesterday and didn't sleep much. Uh, finished a whole bottle of wine, though. <laughs> then I just woke up now and decided to take a shower. Have a long weekend ahead. First of all, let me say, big up to all the people I'm going out to work this morning. Big up to the people I'm coming in from work. Shout out to all my hard-working, good, productive, progressive individuals out there. Yeah? Manners and respect, love and honor to all of them. Hear me out. Shout out to my entrepreneurs. Shout out to my stay-at-home moms and dads. Shout out to my retirees. Shout out to every single person. If I forgot to shout you out, it's not because anything bad. It's because I just forgot. Right? I think I'm still a bit hungover. I don't <laughs> Life is good, man. Life is good. I just got back from beautiful Jamaica again, and it was wonderful. Wonderful. Have a whole bunch of vlogs coming this time from Jamaica. And so just stay tuned. You know how I do. When we get back, we roll out the vlogs. So it was me, Kai Kai, and Brains. And we had a joyful time. Again, the vlogs will start to roll out starting today. And like I said, we have... Stay tuned to her channel as well. I don't know what she has coming for you. I have a bunch of stuff coming for you on my channel. But we'll keep the channels going. With education and entertainment all tied up in one. Yeah. Um, big up to all the people um, who are keeping it clean, keeping it real. We got a lot of love while we were out there in Jamaica. I, I can't express how it feels, you know, to go places and hear people just shout out your name. And people come up and shake your hand and talk to you and want to take picture and all these things. And I'm like, yo, um, I'm not ready for this. Um, I'm such a regular guy kind of person, you know, and I think my wife is too, we're just regular people, but we I get celebrity treatment out our road, and it feels good, it feels good, it means that our hard work is paying off, and our message that we put out there, the messages we put out there, they're actually reaching far and wide, because as you know, we do our shows from overseas, so... To go other places that will go way to Jamaica and anywhere in Jamaica we're at. And we get that kind of reception and that kind of feedback. Yes, me and I show up for real and the show I run for real. <laughs> the way I thought about and I'm taking a shower for real. I want suppose the camera got dropped. Like when time I don't know if you know Kodak Black the rapper. He was doing a live and his camera dropped while he was doing the live. And the man little something you look a tanky tank. <laughs> Show up on the line. What? And they killed him for it. What is that? But it didn't stop him from getting girls and all that anyway. We sure said some girl out there willing to work with the little tanky tank them. So I don't know. <laughs> I'm a married man. Hey, hey, I'm just happy to be back, man. I'm healthy. I have healthy children. What more can I say? I'm thankful. Yeah? May I give thanks this morning. Give thanks for life, yes? It's the weekend. I'm going to go enjoy the weekend. It's still spring break. And for most of the spring break, I was away from the kids because I was in Jamaica. And we get to like catch up on it this weekend. So this weekend, we're probably going to do some beaching. Go to the beach and chill out and go eat some food and them kind of thing there. And just live life and enjoy life. If your life ain't going so good at the moment, I pray that it gets better for you. And I, I'm telling you that it gets greater later. I've done this before where I try to tell people that it gets greater later. Because some people, when you're going through things, you kind of feel like uh, it's, gonna, it's never going to get better. You know, I've seen people leave messages like, 
somebody please talk to me or I need somebody to talk to because I feel like I'm going to end it all today and this kind of stuff. And I'm trying to tell you that life is great. The greatest gift is life. And life is great, right? Even when you're not feeling like... But I understand the whole uh, depression thing and how depression works. The chemical imbalance in the brain and all that. And there are things that you can do to snap out of that moment. To snap out of that feeling of despair, that feeling of down, can't get up. That feeling of the world is on my shoulders and I can't get it off kind of feeling. Just run. Get up and run. And if you can't get up and run, get up and walk. Walk the far. Move around. Yeah? Drink a whole heap of water. Move around. Um, call somebody and talk to them. Something. Don't just sit around making yourself feel more down and more depressed and more fixated on the things that have got you feeling down and depressed. I feel... I feel blessed, but I also feel, I don't want my videos to come out sounding like I am bragging. Oh, I just come back from Jamaica, second time for the year, yeah, and it's only March and I'm feeling good, and all my kids are healthy and everything is going good for me. I feel blessed, and that's me sharing my blessings, letting people know that I am happy and grateful, but I understand that this platform right here is reaching a whole lot of people, and there might be somebody right now who... Tune in to get an uplifting message and end up hearing me bragging. And it go, they go away feeling even more down and depressed than before. Damn, everything I go on for him, nothing I go on for me. My life, I feel out, feel down. You know, might as well just end it all now. I don't want people to feel like that. So that's why I start out by saying good things are happening. I start out by saying... I'm only human enough. Bad things are happening to but I'm not going to put the bad things on the front page. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to focus on the bad things. And that's my message today. Is don't focus on the bad things. That's life. Life, you have to balance out life. Life has good things and bad things happening all the time. And you just have to choose which one you want to focus on. If you want to wake up and be happy, focus on the good things that's happening around you. And if nothing good now happens around you, move from which part of that. I'm going to find somewhere where good things are happening. Yeah? Good things are happening here. That's why it's important to protect your dome. Your thoughts. It's important to protect your thoughts. Your thought process. Because everything starts here and then it materializes. Yeah? So start being happy here. And then happiness will materialize in front of you. Alright? Uh, I don't want people to feel like... May I show off or may, may, may feel like me better than... I'm human. I, I have bad things happening too. But I focus on the good so much I don't even see the bad. So if, you, if you're feeling like you're down today and you're feeling like, yes, yeah, the weekend, but so what? Um, get up, man, and find somewhere to feel good. Yeah? Find somewhere to feel good. I could give you a whole bunch of ways to feel good. And if you tune into this video some more in the comment section, talk to me in the comment section. I try to answer as many people as I can as the day goes by. I mean, I'm doing a bunch of other things, but I will definitely keep looking back as, after posting the videos to see who I can answer and give a word of upliftment and encouragement. You know what I'm saying? We're all supposed to be here to uplift and encourage each other. No man is an island, no man stands alone, and believe it or not, we are more connected than we even think we are. Real talk. Yeah? So... Sometimes, <clears throat> sometimes a stranger can save your life, or a stranger can enlighten you and put you on to knowledge that can take you to that next level, and I might be that stranger on this platform, so tune in, listen, leave your comment in the comment section below, big up yourself, don't feel alone out there if you're going through some things, other people are going through it too. You're, not only, you're never the only one going through what you're going through. And I use that as motivation. Let me close this video out by saying this. I use that as motivation. My motivation is this. If others can do it, I can do it too. If others can survive through it, I can survive through it too. Right? My 10 years in the Army, <clears throat> combat tours and all that, that was one of the things that led me to be able to go forward and go through. 
I saw others doing it. And I told myself, well, if others can do it, I can do it too. If them can jump out a plane and are dead, <coughs> I can do it too. If they can go into combat and come out, I can do it too. If they can do these long road marches with 60 pounds on their backs and all this other stuff, I can do it too. If they can get bigger and strong and have a mind frame of I'm almost invincible kind of mind frame, I can do it too. You know what I mean? Others are going through what you are going through. And I watch others suffer and struggle and go through the same thing that I'm going through or I went through. And they made it through. So it gets greater later. You can do it too. All right? Big up and bless up on yourself, man. Enjoy your weekend. Be safe out there. If you can, be careful. <clears throat> I mean, if you can't be safe, then I don't know what to tell you, but be safe. All right? Life is the greatest. Give thanks. Peace.